Can Tesla FSD handle rain and bad weather? In this video, we're gonna find that out. I press start with FSD. Our car was getting out from the parking lot, but it immediately stopped because there is a vehicle coming from our left side. So FSD respected that, and we are gonna make a left turn here. A little bit of narrow space, so FSD, you know, hesitate a little bit, but immediately make that left turn, and it is raining very bad, guys. I just want to put it out there, and if you're not familiar with me, my name is Anantu Mohamed and I love to film Tesla full self-driving videos in New York. We're gonna make a right turn on this upcoming stop sign, but for that we need to look on our left side and right side. So we stop here for this stop sign. And we're gonna make a right turn here. There are vehicles on our left side. We're gonna see how FSD actually handles this rain condition and how the cameras, you know, like uh, perform in this rainy condition. So we are making a right turn perfectly without any problem. FSD makes that right turn and immediately proceeding. Very good job. This is my first time trying FSD in rain with hardware four. We're gonna see how FSD actually handled the rest of the drive. After making that right turn, FSD, I felt the tire or, you know, like the suspension or whatever it is, it rotates a little hard or slipped a little bit. I don't know with my performance model why 2022 ever happened with that car, but with this one, I definitely felt after making that right turn, the back tires, you know, like trying to rotate a little hard and slipped. Um, you know, like it could be a limitation of a rear wheel drive car, but not like all wheel drive car, but it is something that I face today in FSD. Uh, we're gonna make uh, our march from uh, this uh, road to another road right now in that upcoming stop sign. This is kind of a tricky road. I can't see my back properly because of that um, uh, rain and everything, the water drops. But we're gonna see how FSD actually handles the rest of the drive. We need to move to the left side, but not right over here because this lane is for making a left turn. That lane which is coming right now, you can see that lane right over there. That is not to merge over there. The next one we can definitely get in. We're gonna see if FSD tries to get in. Right now, it's still now, it didn't. I would really prefer, uh, like prefer FSD do that. And now we did that perfectly without any problem. FSD start for the stop sign. If there is no vehicle from the opposite side, we can go and proceed. FSD proceeded perfectly without any confusion. So till now, FSD is handling rain perfectly without any problem, guys. Also, if you're not familiar with me, please, if you like the content, if you like uh, the camera quality, the production quality and the videos please make sure you hit that subscribe button that is absolutely free to support me as a content creator that'll be amazing we're gonna make a left turn and now we're gonna test that narrow road situation where hardware three car struggled we're gonna see how fsd actually handled that so let's do it guys so i engage fsd for the second time the car is taking its time now we're gonna uh, move from there and make a left turn because there's a parked car in front of us so fsd perfectly you know like make a space and uh, avoid that we're making a left here on this narrow road fsd perfectly without any confusion make this left turn on my hardware 3 vehicle it sometimes you know hesitate sometimes it didn't but still i have so many videos on this exact uh, road where hardware 3 cars struggled but in rainy situation with all the raindrops in the camera i still fsd uh 13.2.9 don't even struggle at least like once like it is performing much better compared to my hardware three didn't make any mistake we're gonna make a right turn there our vehicle on our left side we can definitely very nicely human like driving it creeps a little bit and immediately makes that right turn i hope that this is a brand new road and the google uh, doesn't have the data so i really hope fsd will not make a mistake here it did in my last video we're not gonna make a right turn here we're gonna pass this block and then make that right turn on the stop sign, but FSD decided to make this right turn, which is a wrong thing. It is not FSD's fault. It is just following that navigation. Now it realized, oh, what I just did, and now it is probably gonna make a U-turn. You see like how confident it is. It makes that mistake, and then now, uh, 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 what are you doing? Why you're getting into that someone else's driveway? Ah. Uh. This is my first time taking over FSD after so long. 
with hardware um, for a vehicle. So I really don't know why it was just keep going in the backwards and it went onto that driveway. I didn't like that idea. It could just easily stop there and rotate and now it is just fixing itself. You can see the GPS, it still doesn't have the data, but it knows what it needs to do and it makes that right turn. Now it's gonna go. So my question is why didn't it do that at the very first moment? That is my only question. So we're gonna make a right turn right over here and after there is no vehicle on our uh, left side, definitely, and then we can make that. So we make that uh, right turn without any hesitation. Perfectly done. I'm gonna try unprotected left turn. This is a critical unprotected left. If you're familiar with my channel, you know what unprotected left I'm talking about. That unprotected left is kind of like, you need to get out, stop on a stop sign, then creep a little bit to look on the left side, and if there is nothing, you're gonna just go straight, make a right turn, and make a U-turn. It is uh, trying to change the lane, but it uh, slowly creeps, so it, we don't have that much of space right now on our right side to change the lane, but now the light just changed, we can definitely change the lane after um, the car in front of us move. So we're gonna see if FSD, um, okay. So, immediately proceeded, even though there is a car on our um, right side behind, that car also changed the lane. We're gonna make a right turn on this traffic light and then we're gonna test that unprotected left. So, let's do it, guys. Please let me know if this camera angle looks better because I'm using a mirrorless camera today. And, uh, you know, like a mirrorless camera doesn't have that much of stabilization compared to action cameras, but the quality of the footage should look much better compared to an action camera so please leave that comment below that if you are you know like bothered with the stabilization this is a lumix s9 uh lumix is like very good on a stabilization that's why i purchased lumix but the second question or um, opinion is i am keep recording that like i'm recording it like uh vertical videos and everything and i'm also trying like the camera tilted all the way so that i mounted that tilted um i feel like tilted option performs better for stabilization but please let me know what do you think about the performance of this camera so i'm gonna change the navigation right now and test how it performs so let's do it guys i engage fsd it is making a left and there is a car coming our car is probably gonna stop here to give him a space. Wow, this is great. Like it immediately realized that, okay, that car just gets into that driveway so we can proceed and our car just proceeded without any problem. There's a human on uh, in front of us. We're gonna see if FSD, uh, you know, like handles everything perfectly without any problem. So we are just going. Uh, the car avoided that person perfectly. No confusion at all. Now we're gonna stop on this stop sign. There are a few parked car. Um, we're gonna stop here behind this uh, stop sign. We're gonna keep to look on our left side, but if there is nothing, we're gonna go straight, not immediately make that right turn. So we're gonna go straight and wait for the opposite side traffic. This is the thing the FSD did it perfectly. So now we can make this U-turn after this car. Very good job, very, very confident, very good job. No problem at all. Makes that U-turn perfectly. We're gonna do one more time. I just took over just to get into that same road so that I can try it one more time and then we're gonna see how FSD actually handles the unprotected left turn one more time. So let's do it, guys. I engage FSD immediately, as you can see. We're gonna make a not right turn. I don't know why FSD turns on the right indicator instead of left. It is not actually following the GPS. I'm not sure uh, why you're doing it. Let's just, you know, like give the car the option to do whatever it wants to do and then see how FSD actually handles this. Um, the GPS was updated. I'm not sure why FSD did that, but still FSD just makes a mistake, but it is fixing the mistake by itself. I didn't have to do anything. So that's an interesting thing that FSD didn't follow that um, GPS for some reason. I'm not pretty sure why it did that um, and now you can see it just avoided that road and just going from here wow so it probably doesn't want to go to that complicated route it just you know like make a u-turn 
and then um, go from there to make a left. But I'm gonna engage up now so that FSD have to make that unpredictable left turn because we're human and I'm gonna try how FSD actually performs right over here. So we make that left turn and we're gonna avoid this blue car. We're gonna see how FSD actually handles the rest of the drive, guys. I'm so happy with the performance, like in the rain, the rain kind of like a stop right now, but I'm very happy with the performance of unpredictable left turn. So there is a black vehicle in front of us. We're gonna see if it actually FSD tries to go. Wow, this is unbelievable. It avoids that car. We're gonna creep a little bit and there are vehicle in front of us. This is great. Like it just avoid that parked car. It was not actually parked. Like, he was just probably sitting like, you know, like I don't wanna go right now. I'm just gonna sit here for a second, you know. And uh, FSD was going and come over here perfectly without any problem. There is no vehicle on the opposite side. We're gonna immediately make this U-turn and FSD make that U-turn perfectly without any problem. I'm just amazed with the performance FSD is uh, doing here in New York uh, suburb area. I'm gonna take over and then I'm gonna play a game with you right now because I love to play this game with you guys because uh, you also love the game what I play with you because I'm gonna tell you a number and you're just gonna write the number in the comment section so that I know you watched the video till now. So for today's episode, the number will be four. So just write down four in the comment section or whatever you want in the comment section, any suggestion or anything you prefer to tell me. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so much and have a wonderful, wonderful day.